So we finally got a property secured for the plastic into fuel reactor. This is very secluded land all the way in Alabama. It's one of my last options really, but look, to the left, to the right, no houses, no residents, no neighbors. So we'll definitely be safe and keep the safety of everybody prioritized working here. I gotta get an electric pole ran as well. There's one I can tap off of over here. So it's about time we're finally here. So long in the waiting. I'm very excited to finally have some property. Uh, it is very far, it's three hours from me, but you know, it's worth, it's worth doing that drive and, and that sacrifice to keep everybody and myself safe. And uh, also privacy as well and the security of being isolated and away from roads and such, you know, so that's a safety thing as well. But uh, we're finally here, long time coming, and I'm just grateful for this um, opportunity that has finally come about. So we gotta remove this right here. Um, I don't really have to, but it's full of water, so I'm going to remove it. So I left this thing uncovered and look, it's full of water. Obviously gonna dump this oh, out. At this point in the video, my mic had gone out. I think the batteries died. But what I'm doing here is, well, the wheels on the reactor were pretty much exclusive for concrete. Way too small, not even really stable enough for off-roading in any capacity. So it had to be winched up the trailer. And unfortunately in the process of winching up the reactor onto the trailer, there were some further complications that happened, which you're gonna see here. All right, so the metal, the angle iron that the wheels were on contorted way too much when trying to pull this up with the winch. So right now it's jacked and I'm gonna be taking these wheels off and moving them closer to these bars here, putting the hole probably right there so I'll have this support. And then on these back ones, I'm gonna put the holes just right here in this bar. You guys know what time it is. We had to let the reactor see. We had to give the reactor a chance to experience Bucky's. <laughs> And there you have it, the move of the reactor, the plastic into fuel reactor Mark 4.5 into its new home in Alabama, about three hours away from where I stay. So it's going to be quite a voyage to go to and from, 
But as I said in the beginning, it's worth it to keep everybody and myself safe and also for privacy in my works as well. Thank you all very much for watching.